Hello everybody! Today we are playing Mystical Ninja, starring Geomon, originally on the N64. And yeah, we're just going to jump right into it. You know, I haven't played this game in a long time. And I have a lot of memories tied into this. Uh, if you want to know the gist of the story, so far what I know is that some spaceship came crashing in and took the princess or something I don't know it's it's all that's all seems very confusing I guess but um, we're just gonna go for it I don't really remember anything about this game I just remember vaguely enjoying it so we're just gonna jump right into it and try to have some fun Jerk stole my money. Uh, hold on one sec. Okay, all right. So I am going to keep on playing once I get everything. I'm still messing around with my computer settings here. Heck. All right. So I honestly am kind of just wandering here. What's the bridge? The actual Nihon Bashi Bridge? I must say, it is a beautiful bridge. Fit for the honor for o Oido. Well, I was just there, but the bridge that leads to Odeo Castle has been destroyed, so no one can get in. Now what's going to happen? To be continued. So, uh, oh, oh, I think I remember. You need like, you need like uh, <laughs> a a pipe that can reach out to get that. If I remember right, I don't know. Like I said, a lot of this stuff is just kind of I'm having memories here. It's very nostalgic for me in a way because. Oh, oh, you can swim. Okay, I don't remember that. All right, I guess maybe this isn't the way to go. Oh, don't do that. Okay, let's keep exploring. <laughs> wow, I remember this music too. It's like coming all back to me here. Ah, I can feel my blood rushing. I want to totally master the art of swordsmanship. All right, dude, you do that. <laughs> Be careful, there are pickpockets in this area. If your money is stolen, just hit him and get your money back. It's a piece of cake. Thanks for the advice, lady. I'll just hit him. I'll just smack him with my pipe. Also, why I'm using a pipe as a weapon, I'm not entirely sure, but... That's a pickpocket right there. I see him. Uh, yeah! Oh, but he still stole money from me. It's too slow. Front of castle, police box. Yes, what's the matter? I want to know the way to to the checkpoint. The shopping district. Alright. How do I wait a Mount Fuji? The gate with the red pillars near the thunder gate. This will lead you to the fortune teller where you must turn the corner and go straight. There you'll find Kai Highway, which will lead you directly to my. Wow. That simple, is it? Oedo Castle. Passing there and over the Neshi Bridge. I think I just did that, though. 
Where, where does this take me? Oh, this is the police box. Enter Oedio Castle. However, there should be a star block set for emergency uses. You should be able to move forward if you have the chain device used by Makube, the pipe maker. Ah, maybe I need to go to Mount Fuji then. Alright, so the gate with, with the red pillars. These look like red pillars, in a way. Happens, I'll be sure to go to the Thunder Gate. That's the way of my life. Okay. Makabe, the pipe maker who moved to Mount Fuji, is a UFO maniac. You have, after you moved, I should have ta taped him on a video camera. Alright, dude. This looks like a gate with red pillars. <laughs> Climb Mount Fuji. We can get there from around the corner by the fortune tellers. Don't worry, I worry. So I worry. That when something worries you like this, the best thing to do is go to the fortune teller. With the plasma power, your worries will fade away. I'm assuming this is the fortune teller. What is going on? Plasma! Uh, uh, <laughs> plasma man! Howdy, welcome to the plasma fortune teller. I will solve your worries for ten Rio. Plasma! Uh, yes, please. Let's get started. <laughs> if you want to enter Oido Castle, enter on the left hand side when you face this fortune teller. That will take you to Kai Highway, which will lead you to Mount Fuji. Thanks, dude. Your dancing guys are crazy, man. Alright. So, this way then. Oh, I meant to fix my lighting here. There, now you can probably see my face a little better. Wow. Many memories flooding. Yeah, fools, don't mess with me. You get the pipe. I don't think I ever actually beat this game, if I remember right. I really don't think I did. Stamina up dumplings. Sure, I'll try some. Oh, gauge full. It's already full. Alright, well. I'll just continue on my quest to Mount Fuji! Mount Fuji awaits me! I think that's the way I came from. Oh, incoming! Got her. This is cool. I am vaguely recalling what goes on. Again, I don't think I've beaten this game. I don't think I actually managed to when I was younger. I remember it being hard or something. I don't know why I didn't beat it, but maybe I did beat it and I'm just not remembering. But Hey, I found a little kitty cat. Silver fortune doll. Three more, your strength gauge will increase it by one. Sweet. That's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. 
Lock him up. Ooh, yeah. Hoof! Hoof! Let's go to Mount Fuji! Why? So we can meet the pipe maker! Oh, the biggest mountain. Mount Fuji. Oh, we're already here, are we? <laughs> Alright. Climb Mount Fuji, we shall. Watch out for the rocks! Oh, get another silver fortune doll. Two more. Let's do this! Also, what is going on with my character? I mean, I, I vaguely... Isn't there a, a Super Nintendo game or something that was a mystical ninja game? I feel like maybe if I played that, I would understand a little bit more about my character and what, what's going on, but... I don't know, maybe not. Is this maybe uh, some kind of beloved old Japanese comic character or something? Or maybe a TV show in Japan or China? I don't know. Surely it has some kind of cultural significance, otherwise they wouldn't make games out of them. Because there are, there's, there's at least a... I'm, I, I can't remember if it's NES or Super Nintendo, but I'm pretty sure there's a Mystical Ninja game. Uh, that's not just the N64 version. This is the only one I've ever played, but I'm pretty sure they made other ones. I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Whoa, whoa. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yeah. Oh, shoot. <gasps> Well, I guess I should have watched those platforms before I just ran willy-nilly, huh? Go, 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 yeah! Oh, crap. Oh, oh boy. Run past him, run past him! Ah, man, I could have been a lot smarter about that. For some reason, I'm feeling, like, rushed to make progress because you guys are watching, but I know that no matter how fast or slow I go through a game, you'll probably still watch, or you'll just click on another video. It's not like there's any shortages of, vi of my videos or any shortage of other people's videos. It's not all just about me. <laughs> it is. It secretly is all about me. Watch my videos. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You don't have to watch my videos. <laughs> I'm sorry that I'm drinking my coffee while I'm capturing, but I made the silly decision of going and getting coffee and then deciding I wanted to capture immediately after I got home. Don't ask me why, but now you get to watch me drink my coffee. I'm impressed that you made it this far. What do you want from me? What? Do you have a good pipe? Pipe? Well, let's see. Yes! I know. Take this. I'm honored to hand you my pipe. It attaches to the block with the star mark. Yeah, there it is. Chain pipe. I remembered. Cool. Start working across large gaps. Boom, there it is. Alright, well, with that, I will end the first episode of Mystical Ninja. I hope you guys had some fun watching. For me, personally, this is a trip down memory lane. But maybe you guys have never seen this game. And I'm showing you something new. Always a possibility. But until the next episode, I will see you guys later. And thank you so much for watching. I love you all to death.